Well, Joyce and Steve, investigators say it was clear that driver intentionally ran over and killed WSP trooper Justin Schaefer here on this stretch of I-5 back in 2020. Today, Schaefer's parents came to court to try and give Thompson a sense of what he stole from them and this community. This is perhaps one of the most senseless acts I have seen in my career. William Thompson's run from the law ended on March 24th, 2020. Police had been chasing him for miles down I-5 after he allegedly had robbed a store and nearly ran over a clerk. In Chehalis, Washington State Patrol Trooper Justin Schaefer put out spike strips on the freeway to try and stop Thompson. But investigators say Thompson swerved around the spikes and intentionally ran over and killed Schaefer. Thompson was accused of nearly hitting another trooper before eventually crashing and getting arrested. Mr. Thompson, in a single moment, you stole a life, a life we grieve deeply for, a life that now only lives within the beat of my heart. Before learning his sentence from the judge, Thompson had to listen to Schaefer's parents. <clears throat> You're going to have to pardon me. This is going to be hard. Glenn Schaefer was Chehalis's police chief in 2020 and was responding to Thompson's pursuit when he learned what had happened to his son. He wasn't done sharing his love and his smile. He wasn't done building his family and his home. He wasn't done living or exploring or learning. He had more adventures. He had more to do. And it was stolen from him. And it was stolen from us. I would like to apologize to the women and men of the Washington State Patrol. Thompson, who has a history of mental illness, says he wasn't on his medication in March of 2020. I apologize for my actions and hold myself accountable for withdrawing myself from my medication regimen, as well as risking the lives of commuters and safety officials. Members of the community the Schaefer family served raised the funds to put a permanent memorial here at WSP's headquarters, which is about 100 feet from where Trooper Schaefer ended up being killed. Live in Chehalis, Drew Mickelson, King 5 News.